so today we're going to make chicken duck cell, which is onions, mushrooms and garlic stuffed inside a chicken breast. So I'm going to start with the duck cell mixture. So I've finely chopped uh, the onion. You can do that by hand or by machine. Very finely chopped some mushrooms. Done the same with some garlic. And I'm going to start by sweating the onions for five minutes. Then I'm going to add the mushrooms. They don't need long at all. Um, season it well and um, we'll let that cool then we'll, then we'll move on to the chicken. Okay, so to make the duck cell mixture, we've got a knob of butter in a pan. Once that's melted, we are going to um, sweat the onions. We just want those to go soft, we don't want them to burn. Okay, so these onions are just starting to brown now, so we're going to add the mushrooms and the garlic. Okay, so as you can see, these mushrooms now have reduced and they are starting to cook nicely. So we're going to season that well with plenty of black pepper, a little bit of salt, and allow it to cool. Okay, so now we're going to prepare the chicken. We're going to um, place the chicken breast um, onto a piece of cling film, and we're going to cover it with some cling film. And we're going to lightly pound the chicken breast, just to make it a little bit thinner. Okay, so here we are pounding a chicken breast inside cling film. It's important that you don't splash chicken juices all over the kitchen and we'll end up with salmonella poisoning and we don't want that. So if you just pound the chicken breast for a few minutes till it's nice and flat. That way we can um, put the mushroom and onion stuffing into it and it'll roll up nicely. So just a light pounding with a rolling pin. This is a good way of taking your anger out on somebody. Think about somebody that might have upset you or annoyed you recently. And after a few minutes of pounding, we've got a nice flat chicken breast there. Okay, so we're going to put the um, mushroom filling inside the chicken breast. So a nice mound like that if you can see and then we're just going to fold that over now what we're going to do with the cocktail stick we're just going to pop that through the two ends just to hold that together for now and using two rashes of bacon we're going to keep it up we're going to keep the chicken breast upside down so we're going to put one rasher of bacon over the top and wrap the rest of the rasher underneath on one side of the cocktail stick and then we're going to do the same on the other side of the cocktail stick. And that will hold, keep the mixture, in, but we're going to keep the breast upside down so the, the uh, mushroom filling doesn't come out. So we're going to pop those onto a, a lightly greased baking tray and we're going to cook it. Okay, so this chicken has had half an hour in the oven and when we cut into it in the middle, just look how juicy that is inside. 